VoiceThread. VoiceThread is a new tool CSU Fullerton faculty can use to add engaging and interactive learning content. You can share slideshows, images, or video, and participants can have a conversation around it. This is what the interface looks like. VoiceThread is asynchronous like a discussion forum. However, it's not limited to text. Students are encouraged to make voice comments using a mic or webcam, enabling a discussion around and about the media. For example, a PowerPoint presentation. You can even draw on the media using the doodling tool. Let's watch an overview. A VoiceThread is a media player that has a highly interactive discussion space built right within it. Teachers or students upload pictures, videos, presentations, or documents into this online collection that looks and feels like a slideshow, but it's what comes next that's most important. After the media is added, teachers and students will record comments about it, presenting their work, asking questions and answering them, critiquing each other's ideas, and engaging in an ongoing conversation. The skills that students will develop using VoiceThread are exactly the skills now widely accepted as critical to successful learning, working, and frankly just plain living in the 21st century. One of the least known and most interesting facts about VoiceThread is its diversity of uses, from recording kindergartners' narrative storytelling all the way through postgraduate studies in business and medical schools. It's the very same tool used in hundreds of different ways to great effect. So after taking a look at this video, head on over to VoiceThread.com slash research to see all the third-party research that's been conducted on VoiceThread's impact on teaching and learning. As you can see, VoiceThreads are easy to create, easy to add narration, comments, and responses. It's also easy to make and grade VoiceThread assignments. It's a great tool for student engagement. Student content engagement is easy to envision. Not only can students view a voice thread and instructor post, they can create their own voice threads to share information or project results, presentation, their thoughts, feedback. Student-student engagement is facilitated by the ability to both share student work and have a conversation around it. Voice threads support threaded discussion as well as small groups. A math instructor at our university is using VoiceThread this semester with small groups. Each group collaborates to solve a problem. Then they present their solution using VoiceThread with each member of the group discussing a step in the solution. Student instructor engagement is often interwoven with student content engagement. Also, instructors can provide group or class feedback within the VoiceThread. This can be even more powerful if a webcam is used so that students can see the instructor when they are speaking. It's easy to create a voice thread. As you can see here from the voice thread screen, there are just three steps. Step one, add your media. You can drag and drop photos or videos onto the voice thread window. Step two, add narration using the commenting tool. There are five options for you, text, phone, microphone, webcam, and file upload. The instructor can choose to enable all or some of these for student use as well. Step three, share with the class. Just click the button. Otherwise, it's private. Instructors can set up three types of voice thread assignments. You can have students watch a voice thread. For example, you can provide an assignment explanation or a topic presentation. You can set up an assignment where students add comments to a voice thread. For example, their thoughts or feedback. And you can even set up a voice thread that allows students to create their own voice thread. For example, create a presentation or provide a problem solution. Voice threads can be discussed or shared with the whole class or in small groups. So let's get started. To recap, VoiceThread is a user-friendly tool that encourages student engagement of all types. There is a how-to guide along with links to other resources. So it won't take long for you to learn. Have fun!